good jump. Baby shark jumped in the line. Baby shark jumped over the line. So we are going on our daily walk and today Grayson decided he wanted to be baby shark. So I am walking around the neighborhood with my child dressed up in a way too small baby shark costume. I think this is like a 2T. <laughs> yeah. So today is Labor Day. So Anthony has the day off, obviously. And um, Grayson starts preschool tomorrow. So tomorrow is his first day. We are gearing up and getting ready for that. But today it's beautiful. It's like clear skies, 82. So fun. Um, I think we're gonna go on a family walk later today, cause why not? Anthony and I have been doing house projects. I've been trimming trees. Um, Anthony cleared our gutters yesterday and then we borrowed my parents' power washer. So satisfying to watch things like that. Um, we've been blowing away all the mud and dirt and we've been cleaning off rugs and our patio and our deck. and. It looks so much better. Um, Anthony's gonna continue doing that with the siding because we have like some green stuff on our siding. Did you pick a flower? That's so pretty. Do you smell it? Oh. Okay, let's keep walking. So yeah, just getting things done and then we'll go on a walk and then Grace starts preschool tomorrow. So I'm so, so excited for that. I'm getting his board ready. I gotta fill it out. Please have a wish and blow it. Oh yeah, make a wish and blow it. Oh, good job. Mm -hmm. This morning was fun. My mom took my sister and I, and we went to this special shoe store, which I had no idea existed. It was only like 15 minutes down the road from my house. And they like have this fancy 3D machine where they take like a 3D image of your foot and they watch you walk around and they pick shoes off of what your would best like accommodate your foot and then they ask you like are you more of a runner or a walker and so they give you like special shoes and so um my sister and i each got new shoes so i'm trying them out for the first time here's what they look like this was the only color they had it's kind of crazy blue but that's okay um they're called polka i've never heard of this brand before but as you can see it's a very thick like insole or padding they feel really nice they feel um like i'm walking on air my feet are wide and so these shoes are really nice for my wide feet a lot of times when i put shoes on they like my foot feels like it's so confined so this one's nice so it was expensive um but these shoes are really really nice so that was really fun this morning and then like i said yeah we're just doing house projects and walking with baby shark Grayson, come on. Come on, baby shark. Mm So I got out the Halloween decorations and Gray is obsessed with this old snow globe that I have and it's super loud. So sorry that you're having to listen to that. Hi Porter! Hi Bubba! Porter will be one year old one week from today. So yes, today is Grayson's first day of preschool. It's his first day of school ever. He's never gone to school before. It's early in the morning. Turn it off. And we are dressed and having breakfast. And then we're gonna go to preschool. My mom's gonna come and watch Porter for me so I can just take Gray, just him and I. I'm not allowed inside. Hi, Porter. Hi, Bubba. 
I'm not allowed in this school, um, fortunately, so I can only walk them to the door, but it's better than nothing. So yes, the boys are dressed, I am not dressed. I forgot to mention in the previous vlog, I got my hair cut, as you can probably tell, it's a drastic change. Um, I hate it. <laughs> I wanted it to be shoulder length, um, so shorter, but not this short. And somehow she cut it to be above my collarbone. I've never had it this short ever, and I just don't like it. I'm just not a short hair person, so um, not happy with it. But hair grows, so I'm just stuck with it till it grows. So hopefully it grows fast. I do take a prenatal every day just because I know eventually I'm going to get pregnant again, so might as well just stay on those vitamins. And I do think those help my hair grow really fast. Um, hopefully my hair grows fast. But yes, we are doing preschool today. Grayson is so excited. We've got his backpack all ready to go it's got his folder in it it's got his name tag attached to it and a change of clothes just in case we've got his shoes all ready to go he's in his nice little cute outfit i also worked yesterday and um i went on etsy and i got him this cute little board that says you know all about him for the first day of school so i'll show you guys that okay so this is what i got off etsy it was kind of expensive i think because i bought it at a bad time everybody's getting first day of school boards um i covered up the school just for privacy reasons but Grayson's first day of preschool, three years old. He's obviously excited. He loves books, puzzles, and the alphabet. If you know Grayson, you know he loves watching alphabet on YouTube. Um, today's the seventh, and then when he grows up, he wants to be a florist. So kind of funny story with that. We were on a walk one day, and I said, Gray, what do you want to be when you grow up? And we were walking in our neighborhood, and I think at that point he saw flowers and so he just said flowers and so i said oh flowers so you want to be a florist and so now ever since i said that one time every time i ask him what do you want to be when you grow up he tells me a florist so that's what we put on his board he wants to be a florist kind of cute i don't think many three-year-olds have ambitions to be a florist we'll see if it changes <laughs> But yes, that's the board that I have so far. So it's really cute. Um, it came with a little chalkboard crayon. So I was able to fill it out. We're gonna do a little photo shoot on the front porch as soon as we get breakfast and hopefully I can get dressed. So I will um, input pictures here. This is what's happening right now. They're both <laughs> playing on the sidewalk. <laughs> we got pictures. We're about to head to preschool. I'll try and vlog a little bit. I don't know if I'll be able to. Where are you going? Stay here. Oh boy. Okay, Grayson, we made it to preschool. Yeah. Are you so excited? Yeah. Are we going to have so much fun today? You got your name tag? And your, and your backpack? You want to go see your room? Yeah. And go see your teachers? Mrs. Black and Mrs. Blackinger. That's right, those are your teachers. Here's the building right there, it's in a church. Oh, Gray, this is going to be so, so fun. I'm so excited for you. Yay! Are you excited? Yeah. Yay! Okay, so I am back from dropping Grayson off at preschool, so now it's just me and Porter. <laughs> and we have Berkeley. We're dog sitting again. Say hi, Berks. It went really well, though. It's so quiet here without Grayson. Um, we went to the preschool. We got there early. He was so so excited as you saw in the clip to go um, We waited in line to go into 
the classroom and they took his temperature and then just took him inside and I said bye I'll see you soon and so he was fine he didn't cry he did stop a couple times and look back at me like why aren't you coming with me but then he just went in and now he's there right now so I'll pick him up in about an hour the morning goes really fast he's only there for two and a half hours I guess that's preschool for you um, but yeah it was really good there was other kids who were sad like one little boy the director of the preschool had to like pick him up and carry him into the preschool because he kept saying mommy mommy so I think if Grayson was like that it would be a lot harder on me but because he was so excited and so not sad to leave me <laughs> it made it a lot easier so he's there and we'll check in with him when I pick him up on how his first day was <laughs> We go all day. Border Hudson. Oh, border. I didn't even know he knew how to do this. Oh, border. I don't know if he fell asleep in the car or what, but he is refusing his nap. Oh, border. And Grayson, thank goodness, is taking a nap. Oh, good kisses. Oh, good kiss. Ah! Yeah. Okay, so we are back from preschool. Grayson, did you like preschool? Yeah. Did you have so much fun? Yeah. What did you do at preschool? Mm-hmm. Grayson dancing. Yeah, did you color? So these were in his backpack when he got home. It looks like he drew something. Hey Grayson, what is this? He colored this and this was the book that they read. They read Maisie Goes to Preschool. So it looks like he colored this. And then he also colored an octopus. Did you have so much fun? I didn't get a message that he was being bad. He might have, but wasn't too bad, I guess. Um, and he returned in the clothes that I put him in, so he didn't pee his pants. So I call that a win. I did forget to bring his water bottle to preschool, so I had to run home, run back. So that was kind of hectic. I won't be doing that again. But I think he had a great day. His teachers took a picture of him playing, so I'll insert that here. Of course, he's on his own. He has no social skills, but it seems like he had a great day. I asked him if he wants to go back, and he said yes. So we'll take him back on Thursday for more fun. Um, I, of course, I asked him, like, what'd you do? What'd you do? And he just tells me bits and pieces, like a book he read. They sang songs. They sang Head, Shoulders, Knees, and Toes. So he'll tell me things here and there, but for the most part, he doesn't tell me much. Um, you know, his memory, he's a three-year-old, so... He had fun, I think. Um, I asked him, like, who are your friends? And I don't think he knew, like, any of the kids' names. <laughs> so they are all they all wear name tags, but, of course, like, kids can't really read names. So, anyway, it was a great, successful day. I'm so excited that I get to take him back. I'm so excited that this, like, he gets to learn and grow. And um, I just have a really good feeling about preschool. So it was a good day today. put it on? You want to put Berkeley's leash on? Yeah. Oh, you want to go on a walk? Yeah. yeah, you missed it. We took her on a walk this morning while you were at preschool. Yeah. Porter is sleeping. He didn't go down until like almost 2 o'clock. He must have fallen asleep in the car, which I did not... I thought he didn't because every time I parked, he was awake. So I assumed he just stayed awake the whole time. But he must have fallen asleep and taking a short nap because he was not tired at noon when he usually goes to bed. So he's still sleeping. He's probably gonna sleep for a while. Gray wants to go on a walk, but we probably should wait until Porter wakes up so that we all can go together.